So, Mr. Art, tell me about your Stark. How long have you had it? Three weeks. Three weeks, and how much have you ridden it? Two days. Nice. And do you love it or hate it? Absolutely love it. How does it compare to your KTM? No comparison. So smooth, power, torque, everything's right there. All the time. Do you feel like this could be your only bike? It could be, yes. I think so. Battery is probably, like everyone's concern, that goes without say. If you really ride a lot, you will, it will not last. But for just general moto riding, it's it's totally fine. Old man like me, as much as I can get out, yeah, more than enough. You may be older than me, but you're twice as fast as I am. <laughs> what do you suggest I start off in like mode two? You can fire there. If you feel like you need more, you can bump it up to two, that's 45 and so on, 55. I don't think you're gonna make it that far. Yeah, I don't think so either. I'm my first time on a bike this size. I it much more than <laughs> One is more than enough for this track. Okay, and you've got handbrake and foot brake. So normal dirt bike setup. Just like it. Cool. Thank you, sir. I appreciate letting me ride it. It feels weird. Like, you weren't kidding. This, but the seat is so hard. Let's try not to sit too much then, I guess. I did soften up the suspension some, so it shouldn't be too bad. I mean, I'm probably 60 pounds less than you. All right, I'll be back in a minute. Stark Vark, man, this is crazy. I remember when I met with Larry Hughes and I interviewed him before this bike hit the market on the features and the tech involved. This is a crazy cool bike. Now, keep in mind, I'm not a pro racer. I'm not even a racer anymore. I'm just your average Joe vet rider. I'd probably be able to hold my own in the C-Class, but for the most part, I ride like vet open stuff. The power delivery is just amazing. Oh my goodness. And the price is coming down on these too. Uh, I just reached for my clutch. <laughs> it just feels so good. Oh, it's beeping at me. Water pump error. Oh geez. I gotta limp it back. Bike will reduce power and might shut down. I broke his bike. Oh, geez. He's going to be so mad at me. I'm just going to limp it. Well, this isn't good for the video. It's a touchscreen, but my fingers won't identify because of my gloves. It's yelling at me. Yeah, it's been doing that. I think it needs coolant. I think it has like an air pocket in the coolant. It'll go away. It says you have to hold it for three seconds. I tried out there and my fingers weren't registering. You don't worry about it. You sh don't worry about it? The last two days. You sure? Eddie says it's under warranty. I think there might be a little air in the cooling system. Bounces that into the pump. Interesting. Okay. All right. I'll be back then. Attempt two. Let's see how it goes. Engine braking is pretty solid. This is so smooth. I'm 
so weird not hearing an engine. It's always reassuring when the owner tells me, don't worry about the warning lights, you're fine. This is only mode two. I can only imagine what mode six is like. The bars are swept back a little bit too far for my liking, but that might be because I'm used to riding on that RAR I've been on. Brakes work really well, but man, that throttle, that power, it's just awesome. So nice. Oh man, <laughs> this thing is amazing. It is amazing. Fun. Let me come right. and, it, and it handles. Yeah. And it feels right. Yeah. The brakes work great. The suspension in the air is amazing. Because yeah. you can just twitch it. You can lean it. Whatever you need to do. You don't have to brake tap. You just let off. Right. Thank you for letting me ride this. I give it my stamp of approval. I would buy one too. I just don't have the money. <laughs> I'm afraid to ask. It's come down. It's come down a lot. It's actually very comparable to a 450. Uh, 11. I paid 11.3. Would you pay for your 350 or your 300? The 80 horse. Well, my 250 was expensive. The last one in the state, it would not come down. I think I paid 12 by the time I was out. There. See, that's a 250 versus this. I was in mode two and felt like a 250. I can't imagine mode six. That's got to be a monster. Well, you saw I was crying. I was about sitting on the handlebars with the drag strip. Hound. The only time it felt heavy was going up a hill, and I let off the gas. It slowed down a lot, but that might just be the engine regeneration too, because you can adjust all that. So that is something that I'd find frustrating. It being a touchscreen. This one was like two thirty. So here's your modes of one. There's horsepower and there's regenerative braking. Okay, this is awesome. I love it. Thank you, sir.